Welcome to this radio channel, and I wanted to um, take a time to share, once again, a very, very cool project, which is the uh, NCDX IARU International Beacon Project. So you see here on this page, and there will be a link in the description below the video so you can actually join this page, you see a number of beacons that are on the air uh, on a map, and these actually cycle through every 10 minutes. So basically you have a little bit at the bottom here, the uh, frequencies where they are actually uh, broadcasting. So you will have the beacons that are in 20 meters, 17 meters, 15 meters, 12 meters, and 10 meters. And they are of course there to um, help you hear or see or you know understand what propagation is actually working or not. So you have on this page all the beacons that are actually um, working. So you can uh, listen in on some of these beacons. Uh, some are silent, but some are, you know, sometimes they're broken. They need to be fixed. But uh, it is very interesting because the uh, these are really interesting beacons. They cycle through um, two or three, like, you know, um, they use, for example, uh, 100 watts, 10 watts, one watt, or something like that. I'm trying to remember what are the uh, the the the, uh, the power output, but uh, they will also give you an idea of you know propagation throughout the world. So you can listen in, and if you're here, for example, I'm in Montreal, right here on the upper um, eastern part of North America. If I hear W6WX, for example, I know the propagation will be good on that band to California, for example. And what they do is they ID in Morse code, then they have tones of, that they uh, actually deplete in power to see how low power you can actually go and still hear the beacon. And of course, they, of course, cycle through all the time. So that means that you'll have one beacon after it does its tests, it will move on to another beacon and so on. And of course, it cycles through um, on the uh, different beacons every few minutes you have an app available by the way for this both in the ios store for iphone and for the android uh, phones on the uh, google play store so you can uh, just search for ncdx iaru and you'll see the app come up which will actually give you also the uh, live you know what beacon is on the air actually right now depending on the frequency you're using so it's a fun project and it's a fun way to also um, try to see what type of propagation you have. Of course, these beacons are in CW mode or Morse code. If you are, if you don't have a CW mode on your uh, radio, by the way, uh, so for example, if you see here that the frequency is 14100, if you are in single sideband, then tune away, tune, uh, you know, 14102, 103 in lower sideband, or 14098 uh, in upper sideband. So you just tune um, a little off in the frequency. If you have a BFO or if you have a, um, you know, a little um, button that you can change the tone, just move on the BFO when you're on 14100 to make sure you hear it. And as you see here, this is refreshing all the time because it's telling you right now what beacon is transmitting on what frequency. That's what you see on the upper left here, the beacons that are right now broadcasting. So you see, it's very short. They broadcast for, um, you know, a, uh, 10 seconds or something like that. And once they have actually done their broadcast, it moves on to the next uh, beacon and so on. And it moves around like that in a revolving schedule uh, 24 hours a day. So check it out. Another great uh, little website to check out. And you can check out the app for your iPhone and Android phone also at the same time. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.